I have a wonderful electronic invention I want you to see. It, it looks something like this. Why STEM? Do you know, according to the Manufacturing Millennial, 1 in 16,000 high school students who play sports go pro. 1 in 3 high school students who do a STEM activity end up graduating college with a STEM degree. We spend years, time, and money preparing our children for a lifetime of sports. Who's going to prepare our kids for a STEM degree? That's where the Edgerton Explorer Center comes in. Edgerton's impact is making those STEM opportunities possible, and our impact is felt across Nebraska and here locally offering field trips, Edgerton on the Move programs, birthday parties, special events, summer camps, and just a place for family fun, our staff has provided over 200,000 STEM opportunities in 2023 to students, teachers, and families across the state. In 2023, the Edgerton Center has seen 160 scheduled field trips. Field trips give students time to learn, play, and explore in the zone, as well as see at least two of our hands-on science demonstrations, such as Arctic Blast, Raptorology, and Amazing Bubbles, to name a few. And or even do a lab, which could be density tubes, spectroscopes, slime, catapults, or any one of the others. The majority of our field trips occur between the months of March and May. Needless to say, the spring is one of our busiest seasons. With 25 field trips in March, 40 in April, and 31 in May this year. Our summer camp program is very robust. We had over 1,000 students in K through 8th grades that attended a camp in 2023. Due to our incredible sponsors, over one-third of these students were awarded a scholarship so they could attend this camp for free. Attending a camp is a game changer for some families, and some families just can't afford it. Sarah, mom of Logan, told us that financially it isn't possible for my child to attend an Edgerton summer camp until we got a scholarship. The camp scholarship gave my son the opportunity to have fun, but is also learning in the process, which gives me complete happiness. Just telling him he gets an Edgerton scholarship and gets to go to a camp and seeing the joy on his face as a parent, these moments are priceless. Students to Launch is a national STEM education initiative that the Edgerton Explorer Center worked with. Students had a fun-filled day completing the NASA-inspired mission to create Astro Socks with hands-on role-playing challenges while working in small teams. They explored a giant moon map and created postcards that will eventually be sent to space. Did you know the Edgerton Center does birthday parties? It comes with a personalized birthday cake, a hands-on science lab, complimentary goodie bags, and time in the zone. The Edgerton Explorer Center has offered the after-school club since 2012 as a safe educational opportunity for local students during the Aurora Public Schools Early Dismissal Program. Each year, over 50 students attend 36 sessions, which offer a healthy snack, games, STEM activities, field trips, and best of all, camaraderie. The staff loves these weekly interactions, and over the course of 11 years, we've really seen students grow up here. The Edgerton On The Move program reaches people near and far. In Aurora, for instance, the On The Move zone is on the courthouse lawn for Auroran Days. We also work with the Aurora third graders to learn about the monarch butterflies, their migration and habitat restoration, as well as participate in the Citizen Science Project tagging and releasing the monarchs as they fly south for the winter. Our labs and demonstrations have been across the state encouraging hands-on learning. Two of our Science Explosion two-day events, the largest of our Edgerton on the Move programs this year, were to Norris Public Intermediate Elementary Schools, where we served just over 1,000 students with demonstrations and labs. The other was our first time going into another state. We went to Oberlin, Kansas, where we worked with homeschoolers on day one and with students from three different public schools on day two. My name is Jeanette Kelling, and I'm a retired kindergarten teacher from Ord, Nebraska. Well, to say that I absolutely love the Edgerton Explorer Center is an understatement. Our Child Development Committee just sponsored a family literacy night for the K through six students and their families in our community, and everyone absolutely loved it. The kids, the parents, and the teachers, Hello, my name is Bruce Strong and I'm the principal at Woodland Park Elementary in Norfolk, Nebraska. Been partnering with Edgerton for years to do our yearly Woodland Park Science Day and that is a huge hit 
at our school every year with the students, and uh, it's been awesome. It's one of the biggest, uh, funnest days of our entire school year. Our students look forward to it every year, so they will typically come in and do a whole uh, school assembly for us, and then all throughout the day, they're doing small group uh, labs and demonstrations for our kids. Our kids love it, and they're excellent. They're extremely knowledgeable. They're extremely able to get um, science down at the level of a kindergartner, where they enclose them in a bubble or do something crazy like that, uh, or mixing colors, uh, or up with our fourth graders where they're doing um, higher level, making catapults, launching things across the gym. It's a lot of fun. I like for me every year is I generally ask them to let me do something really fun that kids will talk about for a long time. So I've gotten to blow stuff up at assemblies. I've gotten to freeze things and break things at assemblies. All kinds of them, fun things for me uh, that's, that will get kids excited. Uh, about science and I will tell you that Edgerton has been a huge part of that and I would say uh, Edgerton is amazing uh, they are fun they are creative they're very flexible and they've been a great partner to us over the years here at Woodland Park Elementary and I want to tell you Edgerton thank you so much we've enjoyed it and look forward to more years together Thank you for helping us ignite students' passion and for science, technology, engineering, art, and mathematics. It takes a gas, and that gas is flammable. One. Now that was the one that I put a little in. I have a wonderful electronic invention I want you to see. It, it, it looks something like this.